Hi, my name is Christina Govinda and today we're going to talk about the right way to stitch a button onto jeans. There are two different ways that you can stitch a button onto jeans. You can either stitch the button flat down onto the jean or you can use a button attachment using a shank. Creating a shank when stitching on your button might not be necessary depending on the size of button you're using and the thickness of your jean fabric. For this we're going to need a button, a threaded needle, and a pair of scissors. If you're going to be creating a shank, using a darning needle or match will help you do that. To start, we're going to take our threaded needle and tie a knot at the end of it. Next, we're gonna find exactly where we want our button to be. Make sure we clean any extra threads out. You can clip them off. Now we're going to take our button and lay it right down where we want it. I'm gonna take the needle and going through the back of the jean material just stitching on the button going through one hole and then back through the other side through the other hole. We're going to take our darning needle and pass it between the two holes. This will lift our button up off the fabric giving us enough room to create the shank. Now continue stitching your button on. You do at least three passes to secure it. I'm going to do about five. Now that you have your button stitched on, we're going to pull out our darning needle. Taking our needle, we're going to pass through the back of the fabric, but not through the button. Be careful not to pull it very tight. Now we're going to tightly wrap our thread around the button. At least three times, if not four or five. Now I'm going to take my needle and pass it back through to the other side. Now working on the back side of the fabric, I'm going to pass my needle through the fabric and create a knot. I'm going to do this by, instead of pulling your needle all the way through, grabbing the loop, wrapping your needle through it, and pulling tight. And do this one more time, finding your loop, passing your needle through, and pulling it tight. Now we've created a knot, and I'm going to take my needle, pass it through the fabric. Now I'm going to clip my thread. Finding the extra thread from the first knot, I'm going to clip it above the knot. Now your button's on and you didn't even have to go to the tailors. This is very easy and something that anyone can do. Thanks for watching.